Welcome to the step-by-step -step instructions on performing your at-home rapid test for COVID-19. Make sure all items in your kit are at room temperature before performing your test. If your test was frozen or leaking, throw the test away and request a new one. Have a clean, flat surface with a paper towel positioned to place all the testing components on. Wash or sanitize your hands. Then open the testing kit laying the sterile swab, test tube, and at-home PanBio COVID-19 AG test cartridge on the paper towel. Step 1. Open the swab package and remove it. Take your swab and gently rub and roll the swab five times on the inside of each of your child's nostrils. Step 2. Open the pre-filled test tube and insert the swab. Swirl the swab tip in the fluid for 10 seconds, pushing it into the wall of the extraction tube at least five times, and then squeeze out the swab by squeezing the tube with your fingers. Step 3. Break the swab at the break point and close the test tube with the blue twist-on cap, leaving the rest of the swab in the tube. Step 4. Twist off the white dropper cap from the bottom of the test tube. Step 5. Gently squeeze five drops into the round well of the test cartridge, labeled S. Do not move or touch the test device until the test is complete. Step 6. Close and dispose of the tube containing the used swab into the Ziploc bag. Step 7. Set a timer for 15 minutes or watch the clock carefully. Read your result at 15 minutes. Do not read results after 20 minutes as they can be inaccurate. Step 8. Test interpretation. The presence of only the control line, marked C, and no test line, marked T, indicates a negative COVID-19 result. The presence of both the test line T and the control line C indicates a positive COVID-19 result. The presence of any test line, marked T, no matter how faint, indicates a positive result. If the control line marked C is not visible within the result window after performing the test, the result is considered invalid. You should retake your test using a new kit. A new kit can be requested from your contact at your child's school. Step 9. Place the test cartridge and all other testing components back into the bag you were provided. Seal it shut and dispose of it in your regular garbage. Wash or sanitize your hands. You can submit your results online using the Thrive Health app or by requesting a paper form that will be returned to the school the following day. In the case of a positive result, an email will need to be sent immediately to the Office of the Chief Public Health Officer in addition to submitting your results. Parents or guardians can email cpho at gov.nt.ca informing the GNWT of the positive at-home pan-bio test and their child's name. The OCPHO will contact you shortly with further instructions. If your test shows a positive result, you will need to make arrangements with your local public health unit or COVID testing clinic to get a lab-based confirmation COVID test. Make sure to arrange for the second test right away. You will be prioritized for the next available appointment. Remember, if the test results are negative, COVID-19 can still be contracted at any point. It's important to follow all public health measures to help keep you and your family safe. Thank you for your cooperation and support in helping to keep the NWT safe.